Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another stream, uh, pre-season stream, Toulon versus uh, Barnsley, pre-season friendly. They are meant to be streaming it on their Facebook, so if we get that stream to load up or not, it's another matter. I'm quickly going to just do some on computer, guys. So bear with me, anyone in the chat. Thank you for joining. It means the world. Quickly just doing some edits on my computer, just getting the stream up to scratch, as you can hear it in the background thank you to anyone that has joined two people in the chat i'm just sorting my computer out so it'll be one minute drop a thumbs up on the stream i'm gonna be live reacting to barnsley's first pre-season friendly so drop a thumbs up and subscribe i'll be back with you in just one minute guys thumbs up on the stream. there we go i'm just gonna edit my video make sure my stream's working Drop a comment if you're in the stream. Hello, mate. Is it on Facebook? Yes, it's meant to be on Facebook. Thank you to everyone that's joining. And we're live reacting to it, so straight in the stream. All you Barnsley fans, we can talk, we can chat, we can celebrate when we hopefully win. So, yeah, what time does the game kick off, mate? It kicks off at 7 o'clock, so we're just, just under 10 minutes. We're watching it and reacting to it. So, subscribe if you're new. As you guys can see, we're seven subscribers off the um, 1.3k, which is amazing. Hopefully we can get there by the end of the stream. Thank you to everyone that's tuning into the stream. Bear with me a second. I'm just sorting the stream out. It should be all up to scratch in a second. Just making sure everything is fine for you guys. So yeah, everything is sorted. Thank you to everyone in the stream. It means the world for joining. Um, hopefully everything's okay. I've just sorted my computer out now, so everything should be up to scratch. And hopefully I can get this stream up on my phone so I can react to it to you guys. Drop a comment if you're in. Yeah, so the stream is up and running okay, I do believe. We've got six people in the chat already. Two likes on the stream already, which is amazing. Thank you to everyone that joined. I don't get many people joining my stream so every single person that joins it's a bonus to me so thank you for tuning in to the stream today like i say if you haven't subscribed please subscribe as we are seven subscribers off 1.3k and i'm excited to hopefully be able to watch Barnsley's first game of the season see some of the new players in action because yes we've made all these signings but i haven't seen any of them yet we haven't seen any of them played, as I didn't end up going to the Staley Bridge Celtic. So, yeah, if you guys are watching it as well as watching this somehow, let me know when you if you get it up, when they start it. I subbed about 30 minutes ago. Thank you, mate. It means the world. Thank you to everyone that's tuned in. Just on the um, Facebook page now, as they are doing it live, if you guys want to watch it, you said. But make sure you stay in the stream as well. If you guys can get, get, this, get the thingy up, let me know. Kicks off at 8 over there in France, and it kicks off 7 here, so it kicks off in 5 minutes. Um, I think it's great how they're live streaming it, and it's their first pre-season friendly. Toulon, they did win the French 3rd Division, so they're not going to be no mugs. They're not going to be easy, but they're not going to be hard, so um, it's going to be a good game. Um, the the lineup is out, I'll read the starting 11 to you guys if you haven't seen it already. I've got it here. Radlingers in net with the full backs of Ben Williams and Sibic. Sibic. The, the centre half's partnering is Harme, I think I pronounced that wrong, I apologise, and Diabe with TM on one wing, Brown on the other wing, Mowat and McGee in the middle, the usual middle four that we're used to seeing, and then we've got Barre and Woodrow up top, or Barre just behind. I'm not sure what subs are on, it doesn't tell you the subs, and I'm not sure who's going to be playing second half, but obviously we'll find out that very soon. Um, I'm just excited to hopefully see the Reds in action, as obviously we haven't seen them since the last game of the season, and I want to see some of these new players play. Um, for some reason the stream won't come up yet. I don't know if, I don't know why they're starting the stream, but bang on at 8, which is kick-off, but that's what it is. So yeah, let me know your score predictions for the game, Red fans. Heard that Musa Kone is at the game, he's in the stand, yes mate, but there's rumours that if he comes then Keith Moore's leaving, so make what you will of that. Hopefully Moore isn't leaving, but we'll see, Kickoffs is just shortly approaching, drop a like on the stream and subscribe if you're new, 
live. We've got it here, boys. We've got the stream live. Yes, we've got the stream. We've got the stream. We've got the stream. It's amazing. A lot of you guys are probably going to leave to go watch it yourself. It's not the best quality, but I didn't expect it to be the best quality. Yes, we've got the stream waiting for kickoff. Um, if you do stay in my stream over watching the game, or if you are doing both, let me know. It means the world to me, and I can't wait to actually... I, can't, I know I've said it several times, but I can't wait to see them play. As it seems like ages since we've watched them play. Like I say, these are no mugs. Winners of the third division. It's going to be a good test. We've already won the first game, as you guys saw, 5-0 five, five nil, five nil against Stanley Bridge Celtic. I didn't attend that, so I didn't get to see the um, game and how the guys played. I'm watching it and your vid. Thank you. That means a lot. Um, put your score predictions in. Kickoff is just under two minutes away, so put your score predictions in for our second pre-season friendly. Hopefully we can win. Hopefully we can keep the clean sheet. Clean sheet's massive because we're going to need a lot of them in the championship next year. I'm watching stream on my phone and you on my laptop. You're on the big stream. Thank you, mate. That means a lot. Is it BFC Facebook? No, it's the team that we're playing, mate. FC Toulon. It's on their Facebook. Well, thank you for tuning in. I've got the stream up here, guys. I'm sure a lot of you guys will be watching it at home as well. We've got 10 people in the stream, which is amazing. So thank you for everyone tuning in. I wasn't expecting to do this stream. I was just going to do a preview, um, a review video like I did for the Staley Bridge Celtic game. But then I found out the stream in it. Liam Mine, how are you watching it, mate? It's on the on a Facebook stream, so it's not the best quality, but it's better than nothing. That's got over 200 people watching it, and I've got 11 people in, 12 people in now. So I can guarantee you at least half of you guys are subscribed to me. So if you are new, please subscribe. We only need seven subscribers, so if we can get as close to that as possible before the end of the stream, that'd be amazing. 5 0 Reds, that's a very confident prediction. I said to my mate, Bree Barnsley, um, Alex, I said that it is going to be a 3-1 win and I do believe he said a 2-0 win so yeah, hopefully we can win 5 likes, thank you for that guys um, just showing the side of the pitch now, waiting for the players to come out they'll be in the tunnel, Liam Martin has gone for a 4-0 win to Barnsley some very positive some very positive comments, which is great positive Reds fans that's the best thing I like I like that, hopefully we can win as many as the pre-season games possible going into the season um i'm going to be doing obviously this live stream because i've got the stream for this game i'll be doing the match previews for both of the germany games against botcham next wednesday and byfield next saturday and then the saturday after that is a sheffield united game which i'll be going to and i'll be that'll be my first vlog of the season 4-2 Barnsley or 6-1. I'd like it to be 6-1. It's got some really nice goals. Loads of goals. But yeah, with like my first vlog will be Sheffield United at home. As obviously that's our only home uh, friendly of the season. So roll on that. Can't wait to be back at Oakwell. And I'm sure a lot of you guys can't wait to be back at Oakwell as well. So it's not 7 o'clock and the players haven't come out yet. So looking like there's going to be a bit of a delay on kickoff, but more time to talk to you guys. Drop your comments, ask some questions. You know what to do, guys. So, yeah. I've got the stream up ready. Oh, good. 7 o'clock, but they haven't come out yet. The new kit, the new kit, I forgot about that guys, that's just been announced today, what's your thoughts on the new kit, it's very mixed opinions, come on you Reds, yes mate, it's very mixed opinions from the Reds fans, um, a lot of people liking it and a lot of people, what are you watching it on mate, I'm watching it on a Facebook stream, I've already said bro, and yeah, love it, I love it me, I'm definitely getting it. I haven't got a Barnsley shirt in the last couple of years because I haven't really, because they've been so similar every year. I haven't really invested in a shirt, but this year I'm definitely getting one. Malik Wilkes on the back. Hopefully he's number seven. But yeah, a bit of delay to kick off for some reason. It's two minutes past seven already. 
how did you get on the stream? It's on a Facebook live stream, mate. So any of you guys can watch it. So first to have 16 people in my stream. But if you guys can't get the stream, you don't have Facebook, you can't find it, all that good stuff. I'm going to do my live reactions. So stay in the stream. Be describing all the goals to you. Telling you who's, who's looking promising for the Reds. Who's looking under the weather for the Reds. But yeah, the subs are coming out now and the players are coming out. Yes, come on, come on. Walking out now. Woodrow, three goes this game. Fingers crossed, mate. They're coming out. We're wearing our brand new red kit. They're playing in black. First Reds game of the season that we're going to be watching. And I cannot wait to see some of the new players. New players that are playing is obviously Radling in net. We've got Sibic at fullback. Pre-order my shirt already. Nice one. We've got Radlinger, Sibic, the two centre backs, and that's it for this. That's it in this starting eleven. And obviously, you got your likes of Wilkes, Thomases, all them that are starting in this first thing. There's been a slight change to the starting lineup with Brad Collins replacing Radlinger, so that means he's either somewhat bad kicked off or he's pulled up with a knock. Barnsley are going to the Prem, you Reds. Oh, hopefully, guys, hopefully. So, yeah, they're just shaking hands now. Like I say, before this game kicks off, subscribe if you're new. Hopefully the Reds can get, not the three points, but hopefully can get the win. Put some, not some pressure, but show some of the other teams around us that we are not going to be taken lightly this year and we're going to fight to stay up. No names on the back, but numbers... I'm not sure if these numbers that they're playing in will be finalised or these are just roughly. I presume the numbers on the kits will be uh, announced on the Monday when the kits go on sale because they're not going to sell the kits without the finalised number. Uh, Georgina, have you pre-ordered the kit with anyone on the back or just plain? They just shook hands and now they're all mixing up for a farewell for that against racism photo or whatever they do you know what they do guys but yeah they're all just 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 mixing up now can't show the stream anyway because of copyright reasons i know it's not a proper sky sports streamer out but i don't fancy getting copyrighted like i did last time for some stupid reason the lead the reds will be playing left to right from the way we are watching it and Playing in red with white shorts and obviously the striped socks and they're playing in what looks like a full black kit but it could be a dark blue from a distance, I can't really tell. I can't really tell which player is which because the quality is pretty poor but this quality is better than no quality so yeah. It's five past seven, about to kick off. We will be kicking off with looks of it. Oh, they're going to do the handshake, are oh, they going to do the toss, coin toss. What are we saying? Are we getting the kick? Carly Woodrow, it looks like, to kick off. Jacob Brown out on the right wearing the number seven shirt. So if that's finalised, Brown's wearing number seven next year. Tiam on the left. We've got Harme and Diaby at centre back. I'm really excited. Not Woodrow. McGeehan to kick the game off. McGeehan and Mowat playing as their usual central midfield pair in the middle. Very shaky camera. So yeah, come on you Reds, kick off, left to right, keeping possession, let's hope I can start off with, but the pitch is a bit shaky like, little cracks and very, quite mucky in places, but yeah, Diaby on the ball, the absolute tanky looks, tries to play it to Brown, straight to their keeper, so yeah, I am actually so excited for this, feels like for ages since I've watched the bands, the um, bands they play. They're trying to play it out of the back, really smart. Oh, he's nicked it. One nil, one nil already. Yes. Oh my god, what a start! What a start! They try to play it out from the back. Um, we intercept it and put it in the back of the net. I'm not too sure it will, but we're winning one nil already, and we're about two minutes in. Get in. What a start! That was very poor by them, if I'm honest. I don't know what they was trying to do. Tried to play it out of the back. Get in, come on you Reds, yes. What a start by the Reds, 1-0. Tried to play it out of the back, nicked it. I think it was Woodrow up front. Not sure who scored. 
Uber would draw a bar raise there to a plane up front, but 1-0 to Barnsley already. What a start. I'm so happy with that. Just waiting for the tweet to come through to see who scored. Barnsley half-time 4-0, hopefully. Hopefully we can smash him. I'm trying to play it out round back again. Playing it risky. Trying to... Trying to play smart. You guys find out who the goal scorer is. Woodrow scored, yeah. Yeah, I thought it would. I knew it wouldn't. Yeah, Corley Woodrow chips the keeper in the first minute. Yeah, he nicked it off the centre-back. Dinked it off the keeper. Class finish by Woodrow. Get in. That's a great start. And we've won possession back already after losing it. If you want to judge a game off the first minute, then it's a great way to judge it. 1-0 up already. The RB to Sibic. Sibic wins it back. McGeehan gets fouled. Yeah, he gets the foul. Try, trying to read who the players are. As there's no names on the back and it's poor quality. So, yeah. Quick free kick. McGeehan. The RB. Sibic. Just keep from possession round right back while we can. Mount's number four, it looks like, in the middle. Oh, is that Barre? I can't, I can't really tell. But yeah, we're on the tack already. Great defence by their player. 1-0 already, boys. What do you reckon about that? I didn't expect it to 1-0 up, up that quick. Keeping possession early on. There's no scoreboard or else. So I don't really know what uh, minute we're in. Just follow off the tweets. Brad Collins holding possession. Brad Collins back in net after Radlinger. For some reason needed to drop out. Harme out wide to Ben Williams, which is the fullback. Or oh, is Williams playing in the middle? I can't really tell. It's poor quality. Pings it up to Sibbeck, who loses possession. Great block by McGeehan. Brown. Woodrow. Mowat. Playing that nice triangle football. Sibbeck loses possession again. He's lost possession a couple of times already. Great tackle by Mowat. I think it's Mowat, as he always does. Back to his best. Who plays a great through ball to Tiam, but they just intercept it. Otherwise, Tiam was going to be in. Looking dangerous on the counter-attack, but Sibber losing possession a couple of times is what I've noticed. He can't win the header again there. There through. Can't tackle him. Over on the left-hand side. They switch the ball. They've got two men clear on the right-hand side. Tiam has to drop back. Which he does. And we force them back to play it back. So yeah. Not too bad so far. Over top through ball. They flick it on. Diaby wins the header. They've somehow still got possession. They've got it in down right side. For a cross in the box. No one's going to him. And he shoots it over the bar. That was a dangerous chance. He could have easily slotted it by keeper there. But... Decided to smash it over the bar, which was a very bad choice from the attacker on his behalf. So if you are watching the game, guys, let me know what you reckon of it so far. One know the Reds, like I say. Sibic looking a bit shaky. Um, is Radlinger in goal, mate? No, it's... It's Collins. Collins is in net. For some reason, he got changed right at last minute. They didn't explain why, but it was a late change. Collins ended up going in. Radlinger dropping out for some reason. But yeah, keeping more possession, definitely. We're on the attack again. Great through ball from Williams to Tiam. Williams plays it in. One of our players is in. 2 0 if he's not offside. I think he's offside. He's scored. Yeah, offside. Offside, otherwise it would have been 2-0 already. Jesus. Great start going forward from the Reds, definitely. Should have been 2-0, but... Yeah. Brown pressure in there. Centre-back somehow gets a free kick out of that. These are playing it very risky from the back. And our pressure is just putting pressure on them. Looking promising so far. Sibic wins that, but then loses possession straight away. And they've got an overlap on the right hand side. Williams going over to cover. Through ball into their other striker. Harme's not closing him down, but he, he blocks the shot initially, so he makes up for it. And the refs gave Summit, but I don't know what. 
I think he's got a penalty. He's got a penalty. I think it was a handball. Oh no. Yeah, they've got a penalty. Looks like when he's blocked it, he's handballed it. See what Collins can do in that now. First penalty. Can he save it? 1 0 Barnsley to loon with a penalty to equalise it. Is he going to score? Oh, is Collins going to save it? Oh, so close to saving it. He dived the right way. He just squeezed it in back of the net. So, 1 all. Unlucky. Oh, probably more from not closing the defender down. And he's shot it and it's hit his hand and they've got a penalty. And he's only just scored it by Collins. Collins died the right way. That's, that's the post. He's dived and it's literally gone in between that gap. That's how tight it was. So, Toulon won. Barnsley won. After um, seven minutes. So, yeah. I wanted to try to keep that clean sheet for as long as possible, but Toulon have just equalised for you guys that have just joined. It is one all between Toulon and Barnsley in our second pre-season game of the season. I wasn't meant to be doing this stream, but I ended up doing it. So all you that are new, please subscribe. We're so close to 1.3k. I think we need seven subscribers. I've got the game up here. Can't show you, obviously, but subscribe if you're new. I think we seven. We were seven subscribers away before the stream, so all support is appreciated. We're trying to put pressure on them again, but they defend well. The quality turned into a fucking potato, so I can't actually see what's happening at this point. And then they've got another free kick. So from the first seven minutes, attacking-wise, counter-attacking, putting pressure on, looks pretty decent. Defending for some reason, we're not pushing up and closing them down like we were last season, but it is what it is. Brown wins it back, Diaby. Then you've got Brown on the counter-attack, down the right-hand side, he's got one man to meet. He plays it into Woodrow, who dummies it. Or it might have been Barry, who dummies it. And their player picks it up. Expecting someone to be behind them. If I am calling these players wrong from what you guys know, it's because I can't see the numbers and I can't tell who's who. Because of the screening, it's pretty horrible. But, yeah, we've got possession back after losing it ten seconds ago. We're definitely going to have more of the ball this game, I can tell you that. TM on the right gets tackled. Wins are throwing. I know where everyone is, I just can't tell the difference between Mauer, McGee, and Barre. Cause that looks like Barre up front, but it looks too it's too small. I'm really confused anyway. They all have different numbers to normal. Yeah mate, I know it's confusing. Brown's playing at number seven. Woodrow's number nine, I think, or is he number ten? I I can't tell. But we've got possession, tries to switch it straight to keeper. There's definitely goals in it, because their defence is wide open if we play like we can. There's definitely goals in it for the Reds. I do reckon we'll score two or three this game easily. As they're, pass they're passing round the back very, very shakily again. And how they've got away with that, I don't know. Win that, mate. Oh, that's a good sliding tackle. Diaby comes up and sweeps it, though. Uh, Diaby does look big and strong. That like Harme, or Harm, or Halm, I don't know how to pronounce his name. He gave away the penalty. I think, from a handball. That's all I could see anyway. It looks like he's shot. I thought it blocked it initially. And it went out for a throw-in. And the stream's gone really dodgy. So... And the stream stops. Right, anyway. Finally got it back, boys. We've done a really risky throw-in. And that's paid off for him. Unless we nick it here, we can counter-attack. Yeah, I don't know what this foreign football is about. They're playing some really risky in passing. Because if they mess up one of these passes, we're just going to intercept and nick it like we did for the first goal. So, yeah, anyone that's new, I know I'm repeating myself for you guys that are in the stream. What's the score, mate? It's currently one all after about 10, 15 minutes. We are in. We're in. Can we score? A little bit of a scramble. Lazy to Sibbuck. Why don't you shoot? Edge of box. There's a chance here. Woodrow tries to chip it over. Can Sibbert get there? Crosses it in. And he just goes wide. Good chance there. We've got a corner, I do believe. We could have made it 2-1. It is currently one all. Woodrow got the goal for us in the first minute. And then they equalised through a penalty for you guys that are tuning in. 
currently got a corner at the moment. We're looking the better team from what I've seen so far. Missed a chance there. I think keeper saved it, but we've got a corner. Let's see how influential we are from set pieces as we've got so much height in our team. He does a really good set piece. He like laid it off to the edge of the box. One guy dummied it. He shot. All the other guy had to do was tap it in and the keeper saved it. But with the way the keeper's lining up, I think it was offside. So, yeah. Looks like we've been working on some set pieces from that little drill there. If we nix this, we're in. Oh, I'd hate to be a Tulum fan right now. They just... If you guys are watching, I know I'm repeating myself, but they're just passing it so riskily at the back. I don't know how we haven't nicked it and scored more than one at this point. Credit to them, they're doing it well and keeping it besides the first goal. Playing a nice one too to counter attack up the field. Plays it into the middle, their striker plays it on. Through ball, they're in. Diaby comes in and sweeps it up. Great defence by Bambo Diaby. Tian wins it back. McGeehan with a slight tackle, but they gain possession back. Yeah, that Diaby looks good at centre-back from what I've seen so far. And then the rest of the lads are just as what we remembered. One of their trainers is on the pitch, but not on the pitch. Counter-attack, Brown's got so much room. He's got TM over the left. He's got Woodrow in the middle. Brown's got to beat one man and he's in. He tries to cross it. He gets it back. Tries to cross it again. And he goes for a corner. Putting pressure on him a lot more now. We've got another corner. So, like, guys, we're on five likes. If you haven't dropped a like, there's 12 people in the chat, so, ob so obviously you all haven't dropped a like. Drop a like on the stream. We're 26 minutes into this stream. Can we get close to 10 likes? And can you subscribe as well if you haven't already? Because I can put money on all you 13 in the stream, all you 12 in the stream haven't subscribed. So, if you can subscribe, that would be amazing. Got another corner. I think McGean's going to take it in from the right-hand side. Massive bunch of back post. He whips it in. He goes over everybody. Falls to someone at back post. And he goes for a corner. Come on, you Reds. Hey, you can't say that. You can't say that. It's one all for everyone wondering. Woodrow got the goal and they equalised with a penalty. Um, Leeds defender gave the penalty away, I do believe. Nice one, two on the corner. Woodrow making yards. Short cross. They somehow clear it. How we haven't scored a second already, I don't know. Williams, what are you doing? Somehow passes it back to the keeper. That is risky as fuck. Sibber now on the left-hand side. That was very risky from the um, young fullback Ben Williams. Looking promising in a tap, though, definitely. Over 15 people in the stream. A lot more than expected. Everyone that's new, subscribe, drop a like. It's greatly appreciated. Bambo Diaby at centre back, the big beast. He looks good. Brown looking good, linking up with Woodrow on this right hand side. Edge of box to Mauer, it looks like. Can he shoot? He dribbles it through. They somehow play a nice one too, and now they're counter attacking. And is he going to keep it in? Plays it round. There's one centre-back in the way, but he deals with it, and the keeper sweeps it up. We're creating chances early on. It's not early on anymore, it's like 15 minutes in, but... Definitely looks promising. From the attacking side. Number four, I think that's Mauer. I can't really tell. Tries to chip it over the top. That was a poor, poor cross. All the numbers are different, so it's horrible. I don't know who's who. Woodrow's still nine. Brown's gone to seven. McGean's the same, I do believe. And then Mowat in the middle. I don't know why he's gone to number four. What what was Mowat last year? Can't remember. I was probably a really bad fan, but I can't remember what number Mowat was. Mowat was 27 last year, mate. I believe it was Dougal. Yeah, Dougal won number four. 
Mauro at 27. Because Mauro's gone to number 4, it looks like, if I'm not mistaken. Diaby is number 5, which was Pinnock's number. So I presume Diaby is going to be one of the starting centre backs. The other centre back, I can't tell. I think Sibbuck's. Sibic is a single digit number while they cross it in, clear the ball McGeehan, he clears it. Tian looked like number 12 as he came on but that's probably wrong as well. If you guys know any of the um, numbers, because I, I can't tell because of the stream quality. Harme with a great tackle, sliding tackle. Sibic is number 2, yeah. That Harme is number 21. I think the numbers are just for pre-season, yeah mate, they could be temporary. That Harme is number 21, the ex-lead centre-back. So, does that mean Anderson's going to take Lindsay's number 6 and start? Plus, whoever gets given Pinnock 5 and Lindsay 6, you think would be the main starting centre-backs, but we'll have to see. The main starting lineup I'm interested in is the lineup against Jeff United, because he's going to play one of his strongest lineups for our second-to-last pre-season game. Still one all as it stands. The Reds in their second preseason game. Go on, tackle keeper. Keeper's just Cruyff turned our striker and somehow got away with it. Diaby with an insane defensive header. That Diaby looks strong at back. Big and physical. He knows how to win a header. That's for sure. But Taloon starting to have a bit more possession. I'm not touching much of all, that's for sure. Barre is number 10, I think, or is it 18? He's just mugged the left back off. He crosses it in and one of our centre-backs clears it. They're on the attack again. We ball on the edge of the box. They shoot, we block it and they get possession back again. Taluna's starting to get more possession than what we have had so far. I want to see Malik Wilkes in action, guys. What do you say? That keeper thinks he's Manuel Neuer dribbling it out from back. They're doing well, though, doing the one twos to get out of back line. And now the counter attack, that's a great through ball if he's not offside. He's got three men in box across it to He's got one man on edge. He plays it short, and that's what a block that is by Diabe. That is an insane block. That would have happened if he didn't block that. That, that is quality by Diabe again. He's looking good so far. Looks like Mawat on the attack. He's got many options. He plays it through to Tiam. He's got a man at back post. What can he do? What can he do? Edge of box. I don't know who that is. He shoots, and he puts it over the bar. Another chance wasted by the Reds. Just bringing back haunting memories of last season when we missed so many chances, even though we scored so many goals. We missed so many chances and I need to take the charger out of this film and don't knock the stream off. Yeah, that's all right, boys. Right. If you guys want me to stream for the whole game, let me know. As I've, I've had around 10 viewers for the whole stream, so I don't mind streaming. As long as you guys are staying in to watch and you guys are supporting. They're on the attack again. They're going for these counter attacks and this through ball, but he's kept in on on the outer outer edge. Tries to play it back in, but he misjudged the pass. And now we're on for the counter attack again. Four and five. Brown's making the run, but he doesn't pass it. Plays it out left to wherever they are. It's that blurry. I can't see who they are. Plays it into the middle, and their guy sweeps it up. Brown on the edge of the box, that's a fucking, that is a shocking shot. Who were that? That were Brown, that were a poor shot. We could easily be winning by now, but... I don't know, a bit rusty, pre-season, you know, the usual stuff. I thought my stream quality were bad, but I look back at last end, it makes this stream quality look absolutely rubbish. 20 minutes in, Barnsley have tweeted, and even game into him so far, the heat is intense, which is probably affecting it. With some nice football on show from both sides, home side and away side, I agree with that. What's the score, Ben? It is one all after just after 20 minutes. 
Uh, Woodrow with the opening goal, if he missed that bit, and they equalised with a penalty through a handball from the centre-back that we signed from Leeds, Hame. We've got another corner. It's quite an even game, to be fair. Both having a fair share of attacks, but no one really taking any chances, as it's only one all so far. We've got a corner from the left-hand side. Hopefully, with a height, like I said, in the box, we can capitalise from this. Hopefully, we can score. I'm not sure if it's... I think it's Mowat whipping it in. And the keeper catches it. That's a very poor corner. They throw it out. They're just wanting to counter-attack constantly. Is he going to get by Sibirk? No, nope, he's going to dribble it straight out of play. So, as the Barsley Twitter described it, it's very warm. So, it's going to be very intense, which I can see. Hi, Cape United. Thank you for joining the stream, mate. Drop a like on the stream if you're new and subscribe if you're new for these new streams of the 2019-2020 season. Brown attacking the back line. Plays it out wide to Sibic. Number four, which is Mowat, I do believe. McGean on the edge. He's got the gap. Gives it to number 10, which is Barry, I think. Edge of box to Tiab. Can he shoot? Too many men to get by. Williams gets fouled. Free kick on the edge of the box in a dangerous position. Let's see if we've been practising our free kicks in the pre-season. See if we can score from this. No men in the box at the moment. Everyone just lining up on the edge. This is some sort of tactic. Could I have a shout out please? Yeah. Who for uh, Free kicks for Barnsley mate. And everyone subscribe to me and subscribe to Cape United. Who just dropped a comment. I think he's going to be vlogging for Peterborough United next year. Fellow vlogger, so subscribe to him. But yeah, Barnes with a free kick just on the edge of the box. As you can slightly see there. Who is taking it? I honestly can't tell. It looks like Mauer. I think it's Mauer. Or Mauer and Woodrow have stood round it. Or is it Tiam? Or I think it's Tiam. He dummies it. He lays him off. He shoots. What a save by the keeper. Can he get the rebound? Shot on target. The keeper saved it. And then they've cleared it before we can get a rebound. So that's a good free kick to be fair. Keeper had to make a great save. We've got the follow up from the free kick. Pushing out wide. The RB on the right hand side. Gives it to Sibic. Sibic who I've been impressed with so far. The RB who I have been impressed with so far. McGeehan. Tiam plays it out wide to Sibic. What can Sibic do? He beats his man, he crosses it in, and it's too heavy for anyone to get on with. How much is the new Barnes this year? I looked at it earlier, I think it were either 30 or 40. 40 45, I think. If he wins this, the counter attack, Diabe tries to block it. It's 2 on 1. Harmay's the last centre back, he plays it across, it's 1 on 1, and they score. Counter attacking, defenders getting too far up, plays it across, makes it 2 1 to Toulon. That's not good. 2 1 to the home side, get this legend to 1.3k subscribers. Thank you, mate. But yeah, not good for the Reds. We're currently 2 1 down against French side Toulon. Two more players pushing forward. We couldn't break them down, so we tried to bomb our centre backs up. The home side take the lead with a neat finish after a breaking quickly on the Reds as they had men upfield. 25 minutes gone, guys. 2 1 to the home side after going 1 0 up in the first minute. Not good. Getting a bit too complacent and pushing men up. Far away. Am I far away? Jesus, I've gained a couple since I started the stream then. Far away, if you can drop a subscriber and help me get to 1.3k by end of stream, I need four subscribers and subscribe to Cape United as well. He deserves it. How many subs are you on, mate? Once again, we've got possession. We're going forward. We, just, we can't really create much from it. They're, def they're defending well, to be fair. Seven likes on the screen. That's amazing. Thank you. McGee plays a nice one too. Gets it back. Tries to play TM in, but not making the run. What score? Lost connection about 20 minutes ago. It is 2-1 to Toulon. They did get the second goal from a counter-attack. And what did you put? What did you put, Cape? 75, yeah. So close to 100, so subscribe to Cape United.
if you haven't already. I'm going to sit back because I'm getting cramp in my legs. 40 minutes into the stream. Thank you to everyone that's tuned in so far. We are in. We shoot. Yes, get in. Two all. Yes, we just made it two all. I was too busy reading the chat. And we've equalised. I'm not sure who it was because the stream's so blurry. Blurry. But two all. Get in. Back in the game. You Reds. I wait for Barnsley to tweet out to see who's equalised. I want you guys to let me know. I saw the goal. It's not that I'm not watching the game. It's just I can't tell who it was. But yeah, just under half an hour in. And it's 2 all already. So there's a lot of goals in this game so far, guys. Instant reply. Corley Woodrow with a superb finish. He's on fire. Woodrow scored two in his first game and he's just scored a brace in this game. He's got his second goal. What a um What a game for Woodrow so far. Half an hour in he scored both at Red's goals and they've got a counter attack on this left hand side. Can Sibbuck win it? He is very slow. Cuts inside. Brown gets back to help defend and Brown blocks it. I'm not impressed with that Sibbuck so far. It just reminds me of that um What's his name? That um, Kapeka that we used to have. Not a fan of him. If you're watching the stream, let me know your thoughts of him. Or if you went to the Staley Bridge Celtic game, let me know your thoughts. I'm not a fan of him. They're in. Crosses it in. That's a great defensive header by Diabe. He falls to him on edge of box. He does some kick-ups. Gets Ryan Williams. Goes for a goal kick. I bought the new posh shirt for next season. Nice one, mate. I'm getting the new Barnsley shirt. For everyone that's tuning into the stream, it is Tulloon 2, Barnsley 2. Just about half an hour gone. Uh, so, if you would have said 2-2, two -two, I would have I would have took it. Not conceding the two goals, but like I say, these did win the French third division, so the no mugs. We've got a goal kick after the failing to attack. Play it through the middle. McGeehan chops his man, plays it out wide to the left back. Caroline Burt, you Reds, yes, you Reds. Thank you for joining the stream. If you're new, please subscribe. Run the attack again. TM crosses it in, he misses it, and then our player misses it. <sighs> Could easily be winning this game. Sibbuck misses the ball again. McGeehan, that's great strength. Brown wins it back. And somehow I'll give a foul for that. Who scored second? Will. Um, Woodrow got the second, mate. He scored both of our goals so far. Scored two against Staley with Celtic as well. So, he's actually playing really well. TM is poor. TM were poor last season, in my opinion. But, it is what it is. It's too lazy for me. Don't make the runs. He's good on the ball and he can shoot, but he's too lazy. And they're in again, Sibbuck pushing up and he's got no pace to get back. Diaby, great strength to shield him off to make him pass it back. I'm definitely a fan of um, Bambo Diaby, but not that Sibbuck so far. Switches it to a guy what TM should be marking. He goes out for a throwing, luckily for him, but once again, TM should be marking him. Why he's not, I don't have a clue. If anyone could let me know how many subscribers I'm on. That'd be great. I'm still far away or have I got any closer? Because I can't check because I've got my stream on. I've got this stream on. Fullback pushing high, so once they counter attack, they're, they're, they're wingers. They've got no fullbacks to get by. They've only got centre backs to get by. But is he going to give a foul for that? No, he's not. He's going to play on. Sibbuck's out of position again. Oh, it's really frustrating me. It's really frustrating me. 1298, thank you, Will. 1.2, Caroline, thank you. Two subscribers away if what Will says is right, so subscribe if you're new. 13 people in the stream. Thank you to everyone tuning in. It's great. It looks like McGee and someone's down injured. Our trainer's coming on. That's not good. Someone down injured in the first game. One away. One subscriber away. 1.3k. I was trying to hit it for August the 3rd, and what, 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 what date are we on? July the 9th. And we um, are so close, so... 
ya yeah. again currently down with an injury just getting the stream back up One thousand three hundred. Congrats! If that is right, what you're saying. Thank you so much for the support. I did not expect to get anywhere near that when I started this. I tried to get forty subscribers before the season starts. Now I'm on seventy-five. There we go, mate. That proves what you can do. One thousand three hundred guys. Look at that. You can't see it, but yeah, that is amazing. Thank you so much. That is, that is actually. I don't know. Every 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 milestone's a good milestone for me. Yeah, McGeehan's still down injured. They're having a water break because it's very warm. Yeah, McGeehan, yeah, he's down injured. Yeah, McGeehan's down injured. <sighs> if you guys... Yes, congratulations, mate, thank you. If you guys want me to do... Let me know your thoughts while you're in the chat now. I used to do it last season where I used to get up a game like this. Well done, your channel is fab. Thank you, it means the world. Um, I get streams up like this and do my live reactions i'm thinking of doing it for the luton versus middlesbrough game will johnson congrats thank you the luton versus middlesbrough game on the friday night to kick off the efl championship where i'll do a live reaction like this and talk to you guys if you guys are going to tune into streams whenever you can and if you guys want it let me know should i do that i did it last year and he got a good response i tried to do it for the england women semi-final but it didn't do so well i'm doing it for this balance of game and it's doing incredibly well so yeah, yeah, sure. So, I think I'll just do it for the Premier League and Champions League, but, yeah. Number 10 is on the sideline injured. Whoever number 10 is, I, ca I can't tell. Does that mean McGinn's number 10 now? Just reminds me of George Moncur when I see number 10. It's not good. <laughs> But yeah, we're back on the way. Back on the pitch, the guy that were injured. I really don't know who he was. Number 10 is Barre that went down injured. Great work by Mawat to Barre. Finds Woodrow in the middle. That's a great through ball to Sibber. Can he beat his man? He does, kind of. Back to Mawat. Through ball, that's an insane through ball. Woodrow crosses it. There's no one back. There's one back post. Shoot, shoot, shoot. He puts it over the bar. Puts it over the bar. It's a great chance from begging. But great build-up play by the Reds. Barnes need to sign Kone. And we'll need another striker after that if Morley's. Ian Jackson, you're nine away from 1.2k. I sub, mate. You have a good channel. Good lad. Subscribe to each other. All that good stuff. Chaplin will be a decent signing. Yeah, if we sign him. I reckon if more goes, we need two strikers. If more stays, we just need the one. This Kone has been um, rumoured for quite a while, so we'll see. They're doing the nice one-twos again. Where's Tiam? He's a joke. Why is T That's shocking by Williams. Shocking clearance, but luckily they don't get anything, anything from it. Tiam really needs. Tiam's too lazy for me. He was he was same as it last year. Too lazy. He 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 he, he don't he don't he don't track back. But luckily nothing came from it. Sibic team seems too slow. But that is a great pass by him to Woodrow. But Woodrow can't get there. Great defending by the Toulon player. So yeah, I had to guess. He was awful last time in the... Yeah, he was. But then, Ma wasn't the best in the championship last time and we're also scared of him leaving. But, because he did so well in the championship. Got UK, nice one. When will you do your championship prediction? Well, this Sunday, I think it's either three or four week until the season starts, so probably a week or two before the season starts. I'd just like to see who everyone signs. Where do you think we will finish next season? 
Tricky one. I don't think we'll go down. I don't think we'll go down. Not for the first year, anyway. I think we'll, def we'll definitely put up a... Put up a fight for, for survival. I'll probably say about 19th, 20th. I don't care. As long as we, as long as we don't, don't go down again. We'll draw out strength. McGeehan wins it back. Tiam's got the ball. Tiam beats his man. McGeehan's in. Plays it to Woodrow. Is that his hat trick? If he's not offside, that's his hat trick. We've scored, but I think it's Woodrow again. Have a great build up play. McGeehan won the ball. 3 2 to Barnsley. McGeehan won the ball, played it to Tiam. Tiam beat his man, surprisingly. Played in McGeehan, who could have easily scored, and switched it to either Barry or Woodrow. I hope it's Woodrow, because he's gone and bagged an hat trick, which is fucking great. Woodrow's on fire. Wait for the. If you guys know, let me know who scored. Wait for the tweet to come through. It's definitely 3 2 to the Reds. From 1 0 up to 2 1 down to 3 2 up, which is great. Let's hope we don't concede again. Let's go and score a couple. We're definitely better than these. We just need to... I'm aiming for 100 subscribers before the start of the season. Yeah, mate, you'll easily get that. Easily get that. Oh, wow. A special team goal gives the Reds the lead again. Barre is the man to finish. Barre scored. Hey, dude, what's the score? Hey, up the door. Thank you for tuning into the stream. Live reaction to the stream. As you can see, we're playing a French side who's top... Who won the third division... We're currently beating them three two, which is great. In the first half as well, we're winning three two. Getting to see some of the players play instead of just looking at the tweets. We've got another player down injured, which is not great. Who was the captain for tonight, mate? I'm actually not sure. I haven't seen. If I had to guess, I would say McGeehan, like last game, but I'm not sure. Brown was down injured after we just scored the third goal. Got a free kick anyway from it. Brown's back up fine. Hello, Cape. Yeah, thank you for tuning into the stream, Dar. Brown was down injured. Gives it to Sibic on the right hand side. Plays it back to Brown. Plays it across and they intercept it. That's a pure dive by their player. Dives, gets the free kick and stands back up. That is atrocious. But yeah, Barre with a man to get the third goal. I wish it were Woodrow. Just joined, are we playing well? Hey up Joe, thank you for joining the stream. If you are new, subscribe. Drop a like on the stream. Um, attacking wise, yes, we're attacking well. We're creating chances as well. Finishing's lacking again, like normal. And um, defensive wise, Bambo Diabe looks well. Harme looks a bit thingy. Ben Williams is like he was last year. Sibok's a bit off, but yeah. A bit shaky when we go forward because we push our full backs up. And they've got fast wingers, which a lot of teams do in the championship as well. So, yeah, but our main two fullbacks aren't starting. So that could be the reason why, saying that, Sibbuk just did a great tackle there, the counter-attack. But as soon as they win, it's Sibbuk's up the line. So if we lose possession now, they, they get a good chance of counter And he's gone and lost possession straight away. So now Sibbuk's up top at field, they can counter-attack. So now one of our centre-backs on that line. So now it's 2v2. Harme wins it. A lot of pushing up from the defence, which looks a bit dodgy from my behalf, but... They must be doing it for a reason. Mabot on the left-hand side. Through ball to Barre. Can he win it? Woodrow, can he nick it? How have got away with that? <sighs> Great pressure from attacking when they got possession. Been subscribed for ages. Thank you, mate. We've just hit 1.3k, so thank you to everyone that subscribed. And thank you for around 10, 10 viewers throughout the whole stream, which is amazing. I only expected two or three. Both our teams buying players so far. Yes, mate, we've made nine signings. I've seen you sign a couple of players. You've got your new manager. What do you reckon of that? Do you think that'll be beneficial? I'm on 7 7 subscribers. Can we get to 80 before the stream? Yes. Are you going to be vlogging the games next year, Cape? I know you will be, Dar. I watched the one that your mate did while you were away in Turkey. I think it was Turkey. While you were away. Good to see Barre score, yes. He started to pick up his form towards the end of last season. 
We're on the ball again. We're, we're attacking again. It's, it's like waves of possession. But when we have got possession, we are looking well. Gets the cross in. It goes behind the goal. There's subs warming up behind the net. Quite a lot of them. So if that is for us, good chance we're going to have a lot of changes for the second half. If you guys do end up leaving the stream at half time, make sure you come back for the second half. Which would be amazing if you can. Hopefully, I'll be big like you one day. I won't say I'm big. But you'll get there, mate. Just keep grinding. That's all I've done. Upload your content. Interact with your subscribers. Mawat wins a free kick. And you'll and you'll get there. Don't worry. Quick free kick to Sibok. And he's that... He, oh, it's frustrating to watch. Meet up before game, dude. I would, if we come to a Forest game, I definitely would. I'd love to collab with as many people as I can next year. Because collabing and growing is the best thing to do, really, isn't it? Help each other grow, I guess. Another great chance to score. It's literally four on four. And they somehow defend it again. We've had so many chances. We've had chances which are chances. Chances to go forward and break through. We just can't get by that back line. Then once they counter attack, we look we we look so so spread open. Tion's actually defended the ball and he just kept it away. Bloody hell, that was shocking. Now I ring down the right hand side. Can Tion actually win it back? Is that Tion? <laughs> I don't believe it. He actually just defended it and cleared it. No way. And you guys are shocked as I am. TM's actually defended the ball. How many subscribers should I start doing live streams at? Whenever you feel comfortable to do live streams, mate. How many subscribers do you need to do live streams? Live streams. They're in the attack. Through ball to their guy in the left wing. He's at the post. They've just hit the post. Jesus Christ. The defence is looking sloppy as fuck. Where's Mads Anderson? Sibok, you're so slow. Oh, this is frustrating. I don't like him. I'm not a fan of him already. Through ball, that's a shocking touch. It's not easy being a YouTube content creator, but keep going. No, it's not. You go through some good times and some bad times. These are the good times when you've got people in your stream. What's your Who's your favourite Barnes player at the minute? More until he leaves. And then after that, I don't really know. But we're in again. Edge of the box. Penalty. That's a penalty. Have we got a penalty? I think we've got a penalty. 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 Woodrow's going to take it and hopefully get his hat trick. Come on. It's Woodrow stepping up. Woodrow, 4 2 before half time to get his hat trick. Come on. He's going to miss it now. I'm getting this hyped. Monku was my fave, but Mal yeah, Monku were good. Woodrow stepping up to take the penalty. I'm going to show you guys a quick clip of it. He's about to take it. It's, it's currently 3-2 to the Reds and we've got a penalty. You guys can't see. There's no point in me showing you. Come on, Woodrow. This is to make it 4-2, guys, to the Reds. He shoots. Yes! Get in. Identical to their penalty. The keeper goes the right way, but it goes between the post and the keeper's hands. 4-2 to Barnsley. Keep me out. I said, well done. Thank you, mate. 4-2. We're back in the lead by two goals. That's great to see. And our stream's nearly hit an hour, so thank you to everyone that's been in from the start, or thank you to anyone that's been in at all. Um, it means the world to me, just to have people to talk to, and stuff like that. So 4-2, there's definitely no lack of scoring goals, and that's a hatchet. Carly Woodrow with an excellent penalty after Ben Williams is fouled in the box. The stream is free and I follow, yes mate. Monker used to play for us, yes. Four two to the boys in red. When we're attacking, give it to Brown. Brown's in. He's got Brown's in. What's he doing? He could have took it round keeper. Oh, that's frustrating as hell. 
He could have took it round keeper and he just shot it at him. That could have been 5 2 easily, guys. Anyway, Woodrow scoring five goals in his first two games. Let me know your thoughts on that, Red fans. Wax is starting to pick up a bit of play. Who does he play for now? He plays for Luton Town, mate. He signed for them. Midway season. I'm on one, two, three, four subscribers. Yeah. Guys, anyone in the chat like he did to Cape United, go subscribe to Daron Tor. He's on the road to 1.3k like I've just hit. So, yeah, it'll be taking over me soon because he uploads a great content. What's the score, Ben? It is 4-2. Woodrow with a hat trick and Barre we won. Woodrow just scored a penalty. Sub to him. Thank you, Georgina, for subscribing to Dar. He's a good lad. He deserves all the subscribers he can get. Hopefully, they've got a corner now. So hopefully we can keep this 4-2 um, lead going into half-time. Who does he support? He's a Nottingham Forest fan. Nottingham Forest vlogger. Corner, and we clear it for another corner. So yeah, that that's good. Decent side, them. Yeah, they've made some. They made they made quite a few signings this year. Just like us, we signed nine players, including Barre. Eight new players. Another corner whips it in. Cleared the header. We can counter attack from this, and I think that's half time. Then the ref has blown. Listen, pal. Keep up your good work, dude, and I hope you do better than me. Thank you, man. It means a lot. Half time, four two to the Reds. I have subscribed to Dar and Tor. Thank you, mate. Right, it's half time, guys. If you are going to leave the stream, which I don't want you to, make sure you come back in about ten minutes for the second half. But it's four two to the Reds in the first half, which is great. Cheers, Ben. Four two to the Reds in the first half, which is great. Three goals by Super Corley Woodrow. And one from Mike Barre. So, yeah. I'm happy with that. How many Barnsley fans are they? At the ground, I don't know. In the stream, there's 12 people. So, if I had to guess, I'd probably say about 10. <sighs> Have we gained any more subscribers? For some reason, we've dropped down subscribers to 1291. Not sure why. Food. Georgina, you are a girl. I don't know. Are you a girl? Probably. Why? I don't know, mate. I've dropped down to 129 subs. For some reason. 1291, but... Oh, well. So yeah guys, as you can see, 4-2 to the Reds, Woodrow with the hat-trick, and Barre with the goal. We went 1-0 up in the second minute through, I'm not sure who unsubscribed, but it's fine. We went 1-0 up with Corley Woodrow in the second minute with a nice little chip goal. Then they scored through a penalty in the seventh minute through a handball, which looked a bit sketchy to me. And they went 2-1 up in the 25th minute by a counter-attacking goal and they slotted it by the keeper. And we made it 2 all through Carly Woodrow when he... What was the goal like? I forgot. What was what our second goal like? Is that flash scores? Yeah, mate. Uh, Woodrow's first goal was a chip. Woodrow's second goal, he just slotted it through the defence. Third goal in the 37th minute by Barre was a great through play. McGeehan laid him off. And Woodrow got the penalty in the last minute of half-time. So, yeah, it is currently 4-2 at half-time. I'm happy with that. In the second half, I don't care how many we score. I just want to keep them down to two. We're going to look at... While it's half-time, guys, I'm going to look at some of the other pre-season friendlies. Look at some of the scores. Tell you some scores some scores from other pre-season friendlies they may have not it's YouTube servers sending out wrong info probably mate 
We're going to look at some other pre-season friendly scores now. Find some teams that we know of. See what we're saying. A lot of foreign teams. Hull are playing Leighton Orient, which is in the 70th minute. That's currently one all. That's currently two all. Excuse me. That's currently two all. Northampton did play Bournemouth under 21s. That was three all. Uh, Grimsby won, Granton won, yeah. Celtic 4 0, I think, yeah. Rossington Main 0, Doncaster 1. Doncaster winning. Shrews back in a bit, okay, mate. Shrewsbury 0, Chef Wednesday 0 at half time. Tulloon 2, Barnsley 4. Exeter drawing 0 0 with someone. Bradford are beating a team called Brig House 1 0 in the 25th minute. Colchester drawing 0 0. Hamilton winning 1 0. Frickly losing 1 0. Grimsby won, Granton won, Harrogate beating Nairsborough, couple of year uh, thingy teams, Wigan nil nil with AFC Flyd, AFC with more than nil, Bristol City nil, Granton are thirty minutes away from my house. Oh, so that's quite a local team if you ever play them. Barnet winning one nil, South and South End losing one nil to Billery K. I hope you know that. Uh, Carlisle nil, Hibernian nil, Blackpool nil, Dundee FC nil, Markham nil nil with FC United, Frickly AFC, Walsall drawing nil nil with a team called Leamington, Oxford United are drawing, are losing one nil to Oxford City, so that's bad for them, Stockport Town versus Stockport, Plymouth drawing nil nil with a team called Turo, and they are the main friendlies that are taking place right now. So, yeah. Barre's number 10. Begins number 8. Civics number 2. Woodrow's number 9. Uh, Brown's number 7. Tiam is number 11. Mallet's number four, so they're slowly coming back, slowly know the thing is. Uh, Collins is 23, McGee and Day, I've already said that. DRB is number five, Hami is number 21, I think, so yeah. The highlight of the goal is here, I'll show you guys if you can see. If it focuses, here is one of our goals that we did score. Through Barre, this was our third goal, I do believe, to so go three to up. It's very blurry, but you can see it. McGeehan through to Woodrow, gives it to Tiam, gets to Tiam eventually, who beats his man, he plays a McGeehan, who squares it to Barre to tap it home to make it, that was to make it 3 2 guys, which is great. Yeah, we've lost 9 subscribers somehow, I don't know how that works, but sometimes YouTube removes inactive subscribers, so we're only losing 9, I'm not complaining. Grantham are in division below from National League. Oh, so they're not actually too far down than other. Seven likes on the stream. Zero dislikes. Beautiful. Put a little message in the chat, boys. Yeah, while well, it's half time, drop some comments. We've read through some of pre, um, other pre season friendlies. Anyone who's got any mates, any spare accounts, anyone that can tell to subscribe. We've lost 9 subscribers. We did actually hit 1.3k during this stream, which was disappoint, which was good. But we've lost 9 subscribers, inactive subs. God knows.
Thank you to everyone that's staying during the half time. We've got this stream tonight on the Tuesday night. I've got a video scheduled for Friday. A different type of video. Then I've got a video scheduled for... Let me check my calendar. Video scheduled for this Friday, definitely. On the 12th. I've got a video scheduled next Tuesday. For the... It's like a match review. Match preview to the game versus Botcham. And then the game for the Botcham on the Wednesday. And then there'll be a preview for the Byfield game on the 19th on the Friday. And then on the Saturday for the game against Byfield. So I'm uploading this Friday, definitely. Next Tuesday, next Wednesday, next Friday, next Saturday. And then after that, next Friday, next Saturday. And then any signings or selling players in between. So there's a lot of content coming. So make sure you subscribe and put notifications on. Working my ass off to get content out for you. Posh play two rivals in Checker Trade Trophy next season. Cambridge and Northampton. Hey, that'll be good, especially if you beat them. Both League 2, yeah, mate. What, what do you reckon you'll do next season? Do you reckon you'll get promoted? Hopefully. So who's up for having Sam Winnall coming back? Doncaster 2-1 or 2-0 up, yeah. Who's up for having Sam Winnall back? You know how to score goals in the Championship, put it that way, but... A lot of people are obviously funny with him coming back after where you left, the way he celebrated against us. But if he comes back, he comes back. I'm not going to say no. He knows how to score goals. I'm going to look on the Twitter page and see if they've announced any changes for the second half. I'm not sure if they'll... They're going to make some changes for the second half, but... I want to see Malik Wilkes, me. Any of you guys looking forward to seeing him? Is more going? Wait, what did I say? Is more going, yes or no? He's not on the French tour. Like, they've gone to France for the pre season tour. They're playing the one game, and then after this, for next Wednesday, so I presume during the weekend, they'll be going over to Germany. Dougal and Brown was injured, yes. They're playing, they're training, yes. Pinoyos didn't go to France because he was injured, but he is going to be going to the German one. In my opinion, if Moore doesn't go with the lads to Germany for the two friendlies, then yes, he's leaving, unless he's picked up a really serious injury. But if he has, I don't know why the club don't just let us know instead of just keeping us guessing because it's horrible as fans. We need a proven striker at this level. Yes, we do. We need proven players all over pitch, but we're just signing players that we've never heard of. Well, not never heard of, but not players that we watch every day. You've been watching Diaby and that every day and Civic and that. Well, maybe Civic because you're in Wimbledon, but we usually start off well and fall apart. And that sounds like a team I know, you know, called Leeds. Any changes for the second half? What we saying? I reckon they'll change a bit of it. I'm not sure what they'll change, but they'll definitely they'll definitely change it. Don't think they'll change the full start of the eleven because this is definitely a competitive game. They're doing it now on the pitch. Yeah, 
I was waiting for Barnsley to tweet out, and you can see actually who was who, actually who's come on, and actually who was who was actually who was actually what. I'm gonna turn my light on so you guys can see me. Ugh. That any better? Can you actually see? Yeah, it's a bit brighter now. Still light outside, but my room gets dark pretty easy. Right, guys, don't leave the chat just before it gets to half time. I'm gonna go for a quick toilet break, so don't leave the stream. Drop some, share my stream while I'm gone. Drop some questions and that for when I get back. You better not leave, guys. Let's see how many people left the stream. Hey, not many. That's pretty good, actually. Changes, here we go. Collins in net. Cavari at fullback. Diaby, Anderson, Ben Williams is staying. Mauer and McGee in middle. Green, Styles. Green on one wing. Thomas on one wing. Styles behind the striker and Woodrow up front still. So that means no Wilkes. What other new players are missing? Radlinger obviously went off injured. Who else were missing? Pinliossi obviously in there. Moore in there. Green, Brown, Tim's gone off. Just Wilkes. Wilkes, hopefully, he'll come on as a sub. Oh well, a few changes. Back on the way. Second half. We're now playing right to left. Let's see if these... Oh, now I've got to work out all, what all plays are again. Oh, this is going to be horrible. I don't know who's who now. I don't midfield two are the same. We've changed one centre-back. We've got Cavari at right back. Queen on right. Thomas on left. And Styles on Woodrow. I want to see how this Anderson plays. How Anderson and Diaby link up. Come on, you Reds. Come on, you Reds. I'm still here. Thank you for staying, guys. Over an hour easily into the stream. Second half. What's your score predictions? What's it going to end, guys? I'm going for a 5 3 win. Think we'll both score a goal each. Nearly nicks it there. Thomas putting pressure on him. He's going to have to back back to the keeper. I think that's Thomas. He looks small. Thomas, win that, win that, win that. Oh, so close. Good pressure from the lads. How they're getting away with all this. They clear it. That's a really bad clearance. Green's picked it up. Go on, Green. Drive. Through ball. Pass it. He flicks it through. Oh, if you pass that properly. 6-3 to you. That'd be a good result. Yeah, could have got a fifth there, but still far too as it stands. I don't believe there's been eight people signing this the whole time. Seven, I'd take, I'd take another, I'd take another three goals. I only think we'll get one more. That's obstruction, ref. That's obstruction. What the hell? And then he got a free kick from it. Definitely a biased ref. He was sat with it between his legs and we couldn't tackle him. That's fair, isn't it? That's definitely fair. 
there's nine people in the chat and we've got seven likes so can we try to get to 10 likes subscribe if you haven't already on the road back to 1.3k after already getting there which is pretty disappointing but it, it is what it is Them having more of the possession and great defensive header, trying to nick the ball on the counter attack. Like we were doing at the start of the first half. They've got a corner ball now. 4 2 as it stands, guys. Probably about 50 minutes into the game. 5 minutes into the second half. They've got a corner ball. Going for a short ball. We've got a press out. He whips it in. It's gone through everyone. He's got it at back post. No, 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 no. Plays it across. We somehow block it. He plays it across again. He's some... No, he's given another pen. Or he waved it away. Oh, my God. That looked like another pen. He just, he just waved it off. Still 4-2. Yeah, mate. Everyone comment your prediction, yeah. Still 4-2. It looks like they should have just got a pen, but... Somehow, they didn't get a pen. No Malik Wilkes, guys. What do you reckon about that? I want to see him play. Collins with a big kick up to their centre-back. Go on, Woodrow, I'll win it. Woodrow's in. Give it to Green. Green, run. Run. That's a shocking touch. That's a penalty. No, that's a really good tackle, to be fair. Got a corner ball from that. That attack, that were off on one big goal kick. That was actually really well played. The stream's lagging now. No, it's not. Everyone's calling for a pen in the stream, but it were a good tackle. Got a corner on the far side. I'm not sure who's taking it. Can we make it five? That's a really bad cross. Got it a bad... That's... Oh, it's so frustrating. Such a bad corner. Just wasting chances. We used to be minutes taking corners last year. I always fell on a plate for some of our players. Great tackle by Diaby, it looked like, but they've won the ball back, but then we've won it back, but then they've gone for a throw in, it's gone for our throw in. Not too much in the second half, they've had a penalty appeal, and we've had a corner, that's about it so far. Clear it straight into the fucking. Keep that straight out of the stadium, what do you mean? That was a rate clearance, I swear that Diaby did that in his first game. Reckon. One more goal. It's game over. If they get one more goal. Game on. So, yeah. I hope we can try to keep a clean sheet this half. Because the last half didn't go as well. Didn't go as well planned. Sharing the stream. I'll be back in a minute. Thank you, mate. That's a shocking pass by Guevara. Now they've got a chance to counter attack. The play now is 1 2 down the line. And now it's 1 2 again. They really like the 1 2, but that's a great tackle by Manny Middle. Gives it to Green, who has no clue what to do with ball. And we lose possession again. Seems so slow on the ball when we get it. And now they're back to passing it round back. To go for a really long switch. Can Williams get there? He intercepts it. He clears it. Straight to their. Like uh, Woodrow nearly nicks it once again. Thomas putting pressure. How have oh he's intercepted it? Williams, Mauer, give it in middle and you're in. That's a foul. Play on. 
when Williams on left-hand side. That's a great tackle by their defender. Great tackle. We had a good chance to score then, but that's a great defensive tackle. Looking promising when attacking, I say. Williams with a throw to Woodrow. Loses possession, but we get a throw in from it. Williams with a throw on the left hand side. Woody with a nice little flick. Falls back to him, gives it to Mao in the middle. This stream's going really laggy. Tries to give it to Green, misplaces the pass. They counter attack. Nice through ball, but Bambo, he's not going to beat Bambo to the ball, is he? Let's be realistic. Great defence by Bambo Diaby. Him and Anderson pairing up at the back for the second half. For this second half. For this half, which is the second half. Which has 45 minutes, like the first half. Ben Williams beats his man. Woodrow could have turned and played him and goes for their throwing. No, our throwing. I apologise. Subscribe if you're new. Thank you for everyone joining the stream. It's currently 4 2 to Barnsley against Toulon in their French pre season tour. So, yeah, please subscribe while you're new. We've got over 10 people in the chat. It's currently 4 2 to Barnsley, like I said. Hopefully, the Reds can get the win and hopefully, you guys can subscribe. And get me as close to 1.3k as possible as I did hit it earlier, but I lost a couple of subscribers, so all the all the help is appreciated. The stream's nearly on an hour and a half, so we're going strong. We're going strong. And go for the overtop through ball, but it goes out for a throw in we regain position. Shared it in five chats. Thank you, mate. That means a lot. Anderson out wide to Ben Williams, having majority of the possession. Goes for the ball to Thomas, but their right back wins it. Williams wins it back, but then loses it, and they're threatening to counter attack. Play a nice one too. Through ball to their really fast winger. But Diaby plays it again, sweeps up. On FIFA 19, Bristol City. What about him, mate? Whips it in, and that's great hands by Collins to pick up the the cross. Looking to counter attack, but we lose possession again on FIFA. Barnes and nine, nine, nine leads nil. You <laughs> nine nil to Barnsley. The stream's lagging. What's going on, boys? What is going on? Lagging. You hate that circle that spins when it's in a lane. Had a lot of possession this half, definitely. Definitely more possession. Anderson across to Diabe. Gives it to Gavare. They've got the ball back. Now they're pass passing it around back. We've nicked the ball, have we? Thomas has got it. They've. We always seem to nick it, but then they get it back. I have got fifty-two pounds for a new Barnsley shirt. Yes, mate, definitely get one. I I like them. If you like them, get one. You send. I'm a, I'm a fan. Of, I'm a fan of it. I'm definitely gonna pick one up. Oh. Stream's gone really shit quality for some reason. 
I really want to see a goal. I saw six in the first half. I want to see someone score. Five two to Reds, yes or no? Do I think it will be? Hopefully. We definitely got quality to score another goal. It's just it's don't look as strong as we did in the first half, I tell you that. Obviously because we're tired and it's quite 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 warm over there. It's not a cold country. Depending where they are in France, especially if they're down south. It's quite warm down south of France around this time of year. And it's fucking lagging again, what do you mean? Watching me in my 4G. You having a water break? Oh no, we're making subs. Two people are coming on. I can't tell who they are. One's a striker, one's a winger. If you guys know, just come on. You conceded two goals against this team. Hey, mate, they're not even. They're actually a good team. They're not. A, George Miller and Victor Adebayo comes on for Alex Mauer and Carly Woodrow. That's not good substitutions. I want to see Malik Wilkes. No Malik Wilkes for us today, Barnsley fans, it looks like. There's one sub left. But I guess we'll see. Eight likes, thank you to everyone else dropped a like. Subscribe. Someone let me know how many subscribers I'm on. Am I still on 1.291 or have I gone up some? Let me know in the comments. Use a UK that lets me know. But anyone feel free to let me know how many subs I'm on. To the exact point. On the attack again down the right hand side. Green plays it down to Cavare, it looks like. Cavare crosses the edge of the box. Out of edge, oh, that is fucking diabolical. He's a waste of space. He's a waste. Oh, I, I, I hate him so much. Still on one. Alright, cheers, mate. Victor Adebayo, what a waste of space he is sat in our club. You might as well put me there. That's shocking. On the attack again. McGeehan out wide. That's, 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 oh, he's frustrating. That's a horrible pass. How many goals we could have scored? That's on ball. Corner. Throw in and get the ball back. Get the ball back. Ball back. Ball back. Edge of the box, shoe! Keeper saves it. Shot on target, I guess, but. That's a crunching tackle by Cavari. How's he won that? How's that not? <laughs> How's that not a foul? Green, edge of the box. McGeehan, it looks like. Shocking pass, falls to our guy. He fouls him. This ref is giving them bare free kicks. Our guy, our guy were awful. Our guy were awful, mate. We're 0 0 against. Oh, you're an Argyle fan. 0 0 with Turo City. One two nine one yeah, I got to one point three k, but then I lost nine subscribers for some reason. But oh well, if you can help me get close to one point three k, tell your mates, share the stream, any spare accounts, any family members, just do what you need to do. They haven't caused much of a threat. Saying that they're in and go, oh, Collins, what a sweeper keeper, mate. That was quality. Run and you're in. You mad mean. Yeah, they've only caused the one real threat, which was the penalty incident at the start of the second half. Besides that, they haven't done much. It's mainly been us pressing them. A couple of half chances, nothing major, I say. But. That's a good through ball if it's that. Is it our ball? Is it still in? Is it a throw in? Yeah, it's our ball. The fifth goal is coming, I tell you now, guys. It'll be 5 2 in, in, a, in soon. Soon. We'll, we'll get the fifth goal. Horrible throw in, but he gets the ball back. Williams attacking, plays the ball in. What is that for a pass? 
That's a simple pass. If he passes it in, he gets a shot on goal, but he kicks it too hard, and keeper comes and sweeps it. That's basic. Great tackle by Diabe. Victor pressing. Styles and McGee in and out middle, and Adabair, Joe and Miller are up front. Thomas on the ball, gives it to McGee. Back to Dimi Cavare. Diabe to McGeehan. Out wide to Anderson. Sees Williams. Great ball down the line. Williams cuts in. Gives it to Thomas, it looks like. Thomas, what can you do? Gives it back to Diabe. Keeping possession very well. Out wide to Cavare. Sees Green down his line. He's going to take his man on. He's going to try. He's going to lose it. That's great play. We green. That's had a bad joke. He's a joke. Oh, he frustrates me. He's shocking. He had a simple back pass to do, and he passed it straight to their player. Down there on the counter attack once again. Can Cavari get out to him? Can Cavari win it? That's great defence. Gone for their throw in, but that's great defence. They go down the left hand side, they've got a man running in at back post. No! He heads it over the bar. Jesus Christ, that was close. If that were on target, I'd half a chance to win in. Fan contact were off target, yes, Jesus. Still 4 2 guys. It looks like a very bland second half as it's going. He's done with his man. If he wins that he's in. Of course he doesn't. Yeah, still 4 2 to the Reds guys. Thank you for everyone tuning into the stream. Subscribe if you're new. Drop a like. Two more likes gets ten likes, hopefully. Probably not far off halfway through the second half now, if I had to guess. Um Keeping him to two in the second half. Keep him to zero in the second half, actually. Which is probably the main positive, but not scored when you. Back to their keeper. Press it, press it, press it. You'll win it, you'll win it, you'll win it. Oh, if we learn to press, we'd score so many goals against this team. They get another really soft free kick. I play the short ball. That's a great tackle by I think it is Diaby. He looks strong. What's the score? It's still far too, mate, just as you left. Well, as the last time you asked. Still 4-2 to the Reds. That's a great tackle by their player. We've got a throw in. Another third time one of our guys is down injured. Hopefully it's nothing serious. Still 4-2 to the Reds. To the Reds, to the Reds, to the Reds. To the Reds, to the Reds. With temperatures still high, so it looks like it's pretty warm where they're playing. We're currently in the 70th minute, and they're all off for a drinks break while one's down injured. So there's 20 minutes left in this half. 
Hopefully we can score one more and keep them to two. I'll be happy with a 5-2 win. As long as we don't let them score another, I'll be happy with that. So it's still 20 minutes left, which will actually take this stream to two hours. Which is very long, so... I just put my hip out. Yeah, they're having a drinks break now. So I'm gonna... Yeah. See how the stream's doing. Still on the same subscribers, so yeah. Right guys, sorry about that. I was getting delivered my tea. I'm gonna eat on stream. I know it's scruffy as fuck, but I wanna do the whole reaction to the full game. I don't wanna just cut it off halfway through. Got a drink, perfect. Freshen my sins up, freshen my sin up. So yeah, everyone's back on the field after a drink's break. We got throwing in their half. Ten people in the stream. Thank you for watching. Subscribe if you're new. I know I say it so much for you guys that've been here, but for all the new new people that are in, subscribe. And whoa, the red guy in the camera from where we're streaming. Someone's coming off. McGeehan's coming off, and a coloured lad. Is that a, no? I think that's Aiden Marsh. I think that's a young kid. It doesn't look like Wilkes to me. I think it is, I don't know, wait for Barnsley to tweet and I'll tell you who we've brought on. Another change from the Reds, Jordan Helliwell, Jasper Moon and Aidan Marsh all come on. McGeehan, Bambo Diaby and Ben Williams all come off. So we're not just limited to so many subs. We've brought three young kids on, so let's see how we fare now. If we go and concede loads now, then we know our youth isn't very good, but I believe in our youth. Some fucking lasagna boys. Who commented? One, two, nine, two. Thank you to whoever subscribed and they're in. That's a great tackle, whoever the fuck. You put your body on the line, Cavare, man. Win that. Win that. Win that. Oh, I get so into it. I get so into it. Mick tried to be Joe's won it back. He's lost it. Somebody's won it. I don't know who's who because of all kids that are on. They're in. That's a great defensive header by whoever that was at the back. Counter attack and he intercepts it again. 1 2 9 9. Are you just saying that or is that genuine? Cape, can you back that up? Have I just jumped seven subscribers out of nowhere? Because I don't believe that. Is that another pair? No, it's corner. If I have jumped back up, then that means fucking YouTube's. Gone thingy, but I don't think they've gone up seven subscribers that quick.
Fuck that, the corner, but offside. Cape, mate, you're my man. Can can you back up what Ben's saying? Am I going up to one two nine nine? One two nine two. Yeah, I thought you got it wrong, bro. I don't think I jumped up that. One two nine two, yeah. Thought so. Everyone that's new in the chat, drop a subscription. We're eight subscribers off one point three k. Still four two to Barnsley. No goals in the second half so far. But I got a, long, a lot of young kids on. And what are you doing? That's that's that that that's not good. Yeah, I'd say we're about the game will end when my stream gets to two hours, and we've got 15 minutes left at stream, so that means there's 15 minutes left. And they're attacking. Can we clear it? Great defense, Thomas to the center back. Goes for the long ball. That's a good through ball if he gets there. Oh, he's won it. Go on, play it back to Adebayo. Joe, do some of your useless piece of shit. Passes it in middle. Oh, he's a waste of space out of bed, yeah, honestly. What's your ops on Barnes for this season? Uh, from what I've seen, very good going forward. Need a lot sorting out of the back. We look very sloppy. Especially with teams that can fast counter attack. Still yet to see Malik Wilkes. That's a great ball up. We've kept on to that. Go on, Greeny lad. Gives it to Striker. That's a nice one too. That's a foul ref. Foul on edge of box to the Reds. We've just under 15 minutes to go, guys. Going to Prem. Forest relegated to League One. Ooh. I wish. I wish, guys. Free kick. Played a shot, free kick. And they've totally messed that up. What the fuck? Now they're going to counter attack. This is our problem. Got so many men up forward. Lol has. Yeah, but so, so now they're going to counter attack. They've got a man at back post. One on one with the keeper. Oh my god, he's one on one with the keeper and he's just tackled him on the edge of the box and he just gave a free kick. Thank god that was outside box, otherwise, we would have got another pen. <coughs> Now they've got a free kick at the edge of the box. I bet they score from it. Sorry, but ain't... Oh, fucking hell. I mean, let's go in gay as fuck. Lost the stream, guys. It's been the next wank. They're going to score from this free kick. Doncaster 3 0 against Chef Wednesday. What, winning? Against Chef Wednesday? Doncaster won't play in Chef Wednesday, will they? Free kick and he's gone over the bar. Close by them, but not quite. About 10 minutes left of this game, guys. If there's out of time, I don't know if we're going to put out of time on it. Free click, flick it on. Go on, Victor, lad. He's in. Play him. Play him. Oh, my God. We're just wasting so many chances. He 
if any of you guys are watching this stream, can you relate? Oh, it's just me. Who is Doncaster playing? I don't know. I know it's not. I know it's not Chef Wednesday. It's on the league side, I think. Great defence by a young lad. One attack again. If we don't score our fifth goal, I'll be very surprised. Mine's welfare. Yeah, I told you. He's in. Square it. Oh my god, he's cleared it for a corner. How we ain't got our fifth goal, I don't know. We're wasting so many chances. We're getting into some good positions. We just can't finish. Can we try to get to 10 likes on the stream in the last 10 minutes? Surely two of you haven't dropped a like on this stream. On this stream. If you don't like your PS4 watching it or your Xbox and you can't like it, that's fair enough. But Barnes have got another corner as it stands. Ball in. Every single corner has gone too far. We need to take a bit off it. How old? Another free kick on edge of box from um for Barnsley. Just under ten minutes left for the Reds to try and get this fifth goal. We need a fifth goal just to kill the game off. So if these cow attack and get one, these can definitely cow attack and get two in my opinion. Edge your box. Shot goes wide. Shit. Definitely been the more possession team this second half, I can say that for sure. They have had hardly any chances in the second half. They've had the one penalty shout. They had a header at the back post which they put over. Besides of that. Oh my god, he was so cool. He nicked it. Come on. How have we not scored? Got another penalty or what? What's ref doing? I haven't got another penalty, boys. <laughs> I didn't see what happened, but we've got another penalty. Yes, come on. Don't let Victor take this. I'm not sure who's stepping up. Might be one of the young kids to be fair. I'll let him take it. Come on, can we make it 5 2? Keeper saves it. Fuck! Ah, it were a poor penalty to be fair. It were like down middle but to the left a bit. Keeper just saved it. Now they're counter attacking. Now they're going to score. Great defence. Luke Thomas wins a penalty. But his low effort is saved. So Thomas won it. And Thomas missed the penalty for the Reds. Not one man on that post, I know. Yeah, missed the penalty, guys. Would have been nice to get a fifth goal. That would have definitely been game over. Probably just under 10 minutes left now, guys. Three penalties in one game. And six goals. The whip it in. Great hands by Collins. He rolls it out. He wants to start a quick counter-attack. But our players are not lethargic. They don't know what to do. Somehow got it though. Come on, we're in a good position. We can we can get a fifth goal here. Play him in. Play it guys outside. Back post. He literally just mugged them all off and you just missed the ball. Oh, he whipped it back in. Adebayo does a shocking touch like normal and they clear it. We've got it back though on the right side. Green. Green. Beats his man. Green. Shoots. Box it. Ah, I'm missing so many chances. So many chances. 
Could have had about eight goals tonight, seriously. Eight goals. I'm just passing it back, right back at the moment, we're trying to win it back. They're attacking down left, in a good position, cuts inside, crosses it in, clearing header, falls to their guy on the edge, we win it back, they get it back, play it back out wide, another crossing chance, plays it by the man, tries to play it in, he, our player blocks it and it goes for a corner. Corner, corner ball. Nine likes. Can we get one more like in the next four minutes? I bet we can't do it. I bet we can't. I bet we can't. Goes for the short ball. He whips it in. We clear it. He falls to their man again. Dream is like to watch off. Mm. Pretty dead second half, I'm not gonna lie. But thank you to you guys that have actually stuck it out with me. And a massive shout out to KP United. Subscribe to him. He joins every single stream. He comments on a lot of my videos. Great support by him. Great defence again. Clear the ball. I can't. Too far away. Now we've got the ball again, back post, clear it, clear it, well in, touch, turn. Oh, we just lost possession again to give them another chance. Now they're in the box, back post, great save by Collins. I will, I'm at work so can't stay on. Fair enough, Dor, thank you for tuning in for as long as you've tuned in, mate. I will use my other accounts to get five more, thank you. That means a lot. I get one more chance to get one more goal. Collins being brilliant, some yeah he has to be fair. Very sloppy at bat though, I hate to see it. Go on lad. He's in. Green and do something. Green, green! Oh my god, what a save. What a save. We've got ten thumbs up, thank you guys. Been a great stream. So close to ending it, but it's been a great stream. Shouldn't have made it five, could have got our fifth goal there, but great save by their keeper. Scrambling in top corner, come on boys. They get a free kick out of it like always. Another two likes on the stream out of nowhere. If all you guys that are liking can subscribe, that'd be amazing. Need 64 subs to catch you. Oh, yeah, I'm sure you'll do that pretty soon, mate. Especially when you start doing season vlogs. You'll definitely do it soon. Don't worry about that. Thirteen likes, brilliant guys. The stream will be coming to a close soon. As soon as this game ends, fourteen likes now. Thank you guys. Two hours, two hour stream. Definitely one of my longest streams. This game will be ending any second, I tell you now. 
Hope we can get at least one more chance. 15 likes, that is amazing. Currently 4-2 if anyone's new that's joining. Last couple of minutes of this pre-season friendly against Toulouse in France. Free ball, give him it. Ah. He's in. No, he's not. He's wasted it. And is that full time? Nope. I got you another subscriber. Thank you, mate. That means a lot. Coward attack. Play that through ball. We always get so close into their box, but we can just never get the shot away or anything. So we turn our artistic once we get in box. Their player's gone down injured. Call it full time ref. I got and five likes. Don't forget me, Cape. Yeah, don't forget him. That's a great tackle. If he didn't make that tackle, we would have scored there. I can put money on it. Now they're in, they're in, they're in. No, they're not, because Cavari defended it. And the Reds going to get one more attack. I think we're in. Go on, lad. Is that a corner ball? Corner ball to end the second half. Yeah, once again, big thank you to everyone that's been in the stream. If you want me to do more of these, let me know. Hope we can score from this corner to end this second half. Come on, you Reds. Whip the ball in. Comes out to the edge. Shoot. He blocks it. Where's it going to fall? Straight to their keeper's hands. Go on, keeper. Kick it and blow the whistle, ref. Great defensive header, fucking Diahabe. That was quality. He's in. He's in. Over the keeper. Or was it offside? I don't even see what happened. He blew for full time, it must have been offside, so yeah. I think that's full time, guys. Game over. The Reds have won their second pre season game, which is great. So happy with that. Pros, this cons, there'll be a match review, you guys can see that. But yeah, there we go. Sporting Team 2, Barnsley 4. A tough workout for the Reds against a good opponent. Thanks for hosting us, Taloon, I agree. Very good game. Massive thanks to everyone that's been in this stream. It means the world to me. A lot more than what you think. Cool. We'll see you later. Thank you for joining. There's going to be more streams. There's going to be a video on Friday. Don't miss that. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And love you all. See you guys later. When I figure out how to end the stream. See you later, guys. Thanks for coming.